Yeah, my name is Jordan. This is my 2022 Toyota Tundra. Born and raised in Colorado. Been here my whole life. Just moved to Denver about five or six years ago and loving it. I got this about uh, a little over a year ago, so back uh, last February. Picked it up because the 4Runner kind of wasn't cutting it, getting up and down the mountains anymore. We use our Toyotas for adventure rigs, you know. This is basically our snowboarding vehicle, our mountain biking vehicle, all of our camping and everything. Just needed something with a little more power to get up and down these steep hills um, and a little more space for the family. The dogs are a little more comfortable in the back. So it's ultimately why we got one. And then, uh, you know, we love building Toyotas. So uh, it's been such a fun journey building it, man. So yeah, I linked up with Mount Yoda's probably within the last year. Um, they've helped me do a lot of the a lot of the stuff on the truck. Um, we've also linked up with a lot of local companies, kind of develop a lot of the products that you see on it when we initially got the truck. So they did a lot of the installs. Mountain Yoda's been there for pretty much everything else. Favorite aspect of the truck, uh, it's kind of boring. It's all on the inside. I like the power of it. The twin turbo V6 is so nice. 10 speed, there's always power whenever you need it. It's good to feel some boost when you put your pedal to the floor. One of the first things we did with the truck, we took it over to uh, Little Bees, which is here local in uh, Colorado. He built the front bumper off the truck. So that's one of the coolest parts. That's one of my favorite things about the truck, front bumper. It's a limited, so it didn't come looking like this. We swapped the front grill. It's got the pro grill on there, and then all the Baja Designs lights on the front there. On the front, we got the Anzo headlights as well. It's really cool. Nice little DRL, kind of looks like a Raptor. So the wheels and tires, uh, we actually just swapped those. Those are from Relations Race Wheels. And these are their new RR2Hs, so they're the monoforged. Like 10 pounds lighter than the previous setup I had. They ran as a beadlock. Then we got 37 inch tires, so 37 by 12 and a half. Favorite tire by far, they're really great in the rain, snow, dirt, everything. For suspension, it's sitting on some King two and a half inches uh, with the uh, adjusters on the reservoirs. And that's the setup for now with some Total Chaos uh, upper control arms. We'll be switching over actually with Mountain Yodas and their new uh, shock brand, Goat Shocks. So we'll be swapping over to their stuff. It'll be kind of a similar setup, but with some internal bypasses and everything. So in the next couple months, we should see that coming to market, which will be kind of cool. So the bed setup is pretty cool. So this is uh, from Tour Top, fully aluminum bed topper, kind of hinges up so you can still open it with the weight on there. It can hold like 550 pounds of um, dynamic weight. So we got the tent on there, still open it up, get everything inside. And it's got 14, I think 14 M8 channels. So you can mount really whatever you want. They have a lot of their own cool products, but really any like roof rack brand stuff will uh, bolt right into that. So the Possibilities are endless, super strong, it keeps everything secure in the, uh, in the bed. It's got a couple locks on there, so no one can get in there and, and steal your stuff, which is really nice. And then we've got some front runner brackets holding the tent up there. They're a quick release, um, so you can just pop them open, slide the tent on and off if you need to. And then the uh, tent is actually from a local company They're called 4x4 Colorado. That'll be uh, getting swapped out for their full aluminum version. They'll have side rails on it with load bars and everything, which would be really nice, but uh, it's awesome for camping. It's super comfortable. You can swap the gas struts in there. So whatever weight you've got on there, you can swap in the gas struts to hold that. And really you can lift it with just a fingertip. So all the armor on the truck, yeah, you can see the sliders there. Um, it's from RCI Off-Road, also in Colorado. We like to keep it local. So they uh, fit the truck with their whole front skid plate. Um, basically engine all the way back through the transfer case. It's super, super strong. I mean, you can sit this truck on all of that armor and it won't budge, which is really cool. Sliders have uh, top plates that you can take on and off, so you can have that kind of exposed look. You can have a nice step to get in and out of the truck. Toyota, reliability. Uh, my 4Runner that I built prior to this, uh, we still have it in the family. It's been really great to us, aside from, you know, normal maintenance. We haven't had to do anything to it, so just made us stick with the uh, with the Toyota brand. Uh, we like the uh, added space of the bigger truck. This is our full, first full-size truck, uh, so it's nice having the, all that extra room. We love the changes that Toyota made. The interior's you know completely redesigned. It's got a big screen. Um, everything's super super modern, refined, comfortable. Uh, we plan on doing a lot of long road trips in the truck, so this kind of seems to fit the bill for us. Uh, we really like the new styling and the changes at the companies that we've partnered with. Um, it's kind of made it, you know, our own. 
and uh, yeah, we couldn't be happier with it. My name is Jordan. This is my 2022 Tundra. When you're up against the wall and you cannot fall, so come on, come on.